Betelgeuse is one of the closest supernova candidates to Earth. Situated 700 light years away from Earth, this supergiant star is extremely active and in the final stages of its life. Betelgeuse is easily visible in the night sky. It is the 10th brightest star in the night sky and is more than 11 times the mass of the Sun. Traveling to Betelgeuse would be impossible using current technology. It would take you more than 10 million years to get there at the speed of NASA's New Horizon spacecraft. But imagine, what would it be like to visit a red supergiant star that is in its final stages of life? The surface of Betelgeuse is relatively colder than the Sun, since its core is no longer capable of sustaining hydrogen fusion the temperature of its surface is just 3500 Kelvin. Betelgeuse is so huge that if it were at the center of the solar system, its surface would lie beyond the asteroid belt, and it would engulf the orbits of Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, and possibly even Jupiter. Betelgeuse is only 10 million years old. Astronomers suspect it would live for another 100,000 years, after which its core would collapse into a super-dense neutron star. This supernova explosion might appear as bright as the full moon, as seen from Earth. This brightness would last for several months and would even be visible during the day. Since the star is 700 light years away from Earth, the light that left from the star in the year 1320 is reaching us now. Betelgeuse is quite mysterious. The star undergoes irregular dimming and brightening and has been known to do so for many years. Astronomers know very little about red supergiant stars and their behavior. Visiting Betelgeuse and unraveling its mysteries would definitely make for an amazing experience. Understanding Betelgeuse might also help us understand what the end stages of our Sun would look like. The day when Betelgeuse ends its life is not known. Who knows, the star might have already ended its life several hundred years ago, but the light from the explosion is yet to reach Earth. <laughs>